Hey guys, it's me Anaf and welcome to part 6 of the Learn Discord.py tutorial series. In this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to set your own bot status for your Discord.py bot. So what are bot status? Uh, so bot statuses are like, you, uh, check over here, we have EXO. So EXO has a status called listening to x.help, currently in 41 servers. So this is called a bot status, just like we have user statuses, like if you're playing a game, Discord detects it and then it says that playing this game or we can set our own custom statuses uh, and we can also set our uh, activity statuses to online, idle, do not disturb, invisible and whatever you want. So we can also set statuses like those for our discord.py bots. But one thing to note is that discord.py doesn't support like almost any discord API uh, bots don't support the custom statuses because that's a restriction of the discord api so let's get started on how to make your own bot status so i've made a new file this is a clean one where i'm going to be starting and you have to set your bot status in the on ready method because all bots do that so it's going to be really simple just one line of code and you're done so i guess it's going to be a really short video and but it's going to be the only thing that I'm going to be showing you here. So in the onReady method, what we are going to be doing is typing await bot.changePresence. Okay, and I have auto completion here on Visual Studio Code. So bot.changePresence is parentheses. Now status is going to be, so the status is actually if you're online or idle or not disturbed or if you're invisible. So these are called statuses. And this thing is called the activity. So we're going to be setting the status first. So the status is going to be discord dot status capital S status dot you can do online do uh, idle or you can do invisible. Okay, you can do like any one of them. But for now I'm going to be using online. Okay, and our status is going to be online, then use a comma. And now we're going to be setting the activity. So the activity is going to be, oh sorry, is going to be discord.activity, parentheses. Let me now press enter just to make the code a bit more readable. So activity is equal to discord.activity, parentheses. And now the type is going to be discord.activity type activity type so discord dot activity type dot we can do uh, even though there's custom over here it doesn't work it's just there so discord dot activity type I can you can use playing uh, or you can use streaming you can use uh, watching or you can use listening okay so for now I'm going to be using playing okay so playing now the name of the activity is going to be the game or whatever you're using. So listening to this is going to be the uh, the type and the x dot help currently in 41 servers. As you can see, this is in bold and this is the name of your activity. So the name of the activity for now is going to be uh, playing Discord dot pi. Okay, just. I'm just gonna name it Discord. Okay, so now let's save it and let's run the bot. Oh, I don't have a terminal open. Well, let me just open a terminal over here. How about that? Okay, since I don't have my terminal open, I guess I can open open it over here. So let's drag it and now let me do Python bot .py. So let's wait and once the bot gets once the bot gets online, it's gonna be printing ready. So since yeah it's online as is, as you can see that playing a game discord.py so this is the bot status uh, you can also set it to listening now let's restart the bot and it takes a bit of time for the status to appear if you're doing it like uh, very quickly so at as you can see, it's saying that listening to discord.py. Now you can name it whatever you want, and I can name it test. Now let's do watching. 
now let's run the bot again and let's wait for the bot to get ready as you can see watching test so this is how you can set your own bot status and custom statuses are not supported by the discord api but except that you can use anything so that's it for this video i hope you enjoyed it and if you did be sure to like the video and subscribe to my channel and if you guys need any help you can join my official discord help server the link will be in the description below so i'll see you in the next video peace out